it was right about seventh, eighth grade that she kind of decided, I just want to play basketball. She always had goals, and, and some of them were appropriate for the age. You know, I want to make the team. I want to start on the team. I want to make all county, and then it just kind of kept going. When I was 14 and I had opportunity to play in Mexico City on the under-16 team, and from there on it was like, you know, if I keep doing this, hopefully I can play in the Olympics, and then that was my biggest goal. As she progressed, we realized that she was kind of unique. It's funny because like I was so young. Uh, I remember calling my parents, it was like, I made it. And they were like, what? She called and she said, uh, Dad, I made the team. He got emotional and I was kind of like, Dad, it's a secret. Don't tell anybody. Stop crying. You're at work. People can't see you crying. Only two times I've teared up for her and that was at 14 and here at uh, 21. Uh, and it was the exact same message from her each time. I think the Olympics were the big prize for her. My first thought is Olympics is up here. Only a certain amount of people say that they get to experience an, an Olympics and, and be an Olympian. There's always those thoughts that she's kind of the baby on the team, the newbie. You know, you want to see her be successful where she can you know, bring confidence to her teammates and her coaching staff. To be able to be on this team with the, the 11 other best players in the world uh, and just learn from them. They're on this journey to have fun and to, to win a gold medal just like I am. She just goes out and plays hard. She's very competitive. I would say, you know, the energy, it comes from within us. You know, we know what we have to do because one thing that I've definitely learned since playing USA basketball is no matter what level you're at, everyone wants to beat USA. Brianna's drive is why she's so special. She, she wanted this. She wanted this and there's a lot of, a lot of kids that work hard and uh, you know sometimes that doesn't get you there, you know. Uh, you need a couple other things to, to line up. Uh, her drive, if she didn't have her drive, None of this would have happened.